I'm heading now to Absolute MMA, Shanghai. It's Dorothy down there, so I wanna go and film it. I wanna train there. And it's already night. Beautiful. In this moment, I'm in Shanghai Road, and I supposed to meet Dorothy in some place somewhere close. Yeah, I think I'm here. I should go like. She told me beware because I'm gonna be with a gi in the street, which I don't see it yet. Okay. Welcome to Shanghai. <laughs> <laughs> Do you want to change? So, the nice part of the day, getting some training, coming straight away from dinner with my gi, going for some training. Thanks a lot of for hooking me up with this. Giovanni Ferrari, I'm from Brazil, 23 years old. I used to train with Ed Ramos. Yeah. He was Atos before, and then he left Atos. And you moved here, why? Why China? Man, I was invited to come, and it, for me it was like a nice opportunity to learn. I was like really excited to come and see how was Jiu Jitsu in China, how it was growing, and I can feel like now it's really getting like really improving Jiu Jitsu in China. I think it's really getting better. Maybe two or three years, it's gonna be like huge. It's amazing how China is growing. Man, so much, bro. It's fast. I didn't expect. Like, man, it's gonna take so long. It's gonna be hard. But this year, things like it's just like bah, 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 popping everywhere. How long you been here in Absolute? Um, I'm actually not a member here. I, I, they're all my all my good friends, and uh, I'm, I'm close to all of them. Like Rob is, is one of the first person I met when I arrived in Shanghai ten years ago. Friends, I'm half American, half French, but I, I grew up in France. Uh, yeah, I come from striking background. Actually, even before that, I was I was I started with judo. Then I did Muay Thai and kickboxing for uh, well since I was like 18, so like uh, 17 actually, so like 13 years. And I switched, started switching to MMA three years ago. But actually, it wasn't my choice. I got I started going with a, uh, a local team, local fight team, and they were like focused on MMA. So I was just there, just partaking in the striking part. And little by little, I was like, okay, fuck, I gotta try, right? I was not really, not really attracted to it, the grappling. Actually, so Warzone is when I really started to get into it. Like, I had to, because I had an MMA fight scheduled. So I really pushed more on the grappling side and got addicted, man. Do you fight pro? I got a job, so it's not my, it's not my full-time thing. Yeah, I do one, two, three times, three fights a year at most, if I can. white belts 
what makes me happy. People starting to train, that's making me happy. You're teaching everything from, from like the first step until he learn like everything that he will save through the whole life. I think that's the magic.